We are a week away from Fort for Fitness Fall Festival, and joining us to tell more about the festival is Executive Director Satin Lemon. Satin, good morning. How good morning. are you? Good. How are you? Good. All right. So this kind of creeped up on us. We were just yep. talking about mm -hmm. it. It is a week <laughs> away. Uh, this is a annual event. Most people know about it, but for those that don't know what the Fort for Fitness Fall Festival is, what is it? So this is actually our 15th year, so that's exciting. Um, and it's a running event or a walking event. You don't have to run it. Um, but we do three different races, and then the ultimate challenge is if you wanted to do all three of them together, which is a fourth race called the Triple Crown. So we do a four mile, a 10K, and a half marathon. And that's a lot of running if you want to do all of them. So yes. mad props to anybody that has signed up for that. <laughs> we have about 80 of them. Wow. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Good luck. Um, but if somebody doesn't want to come out on Saturday morning next week, are there still options to participate? Yeah. So we have a virtual option. We've been offering that um, since 2020, um, and we because we had a lot of people that you know took that option and enjoyed doing it that way, or maybe they've done it every year and they're just not able to make it that day, um, and they don't want to miss out, you know, on the shirt and the bling and all of that. So we do offer that option um, as well. And if somebody were to sign up between now and the last day to register is? Wednesday. Wednesday. This Wednesday so online. if somebody were to sign up between now, what is guaranteed for them? So we still have um, shirts and the goodie bags and the medals um, as of right now. But, you know, mm -hmm. you have to order those things so far in advance. But as of right now, we're still in good shape. Um, we just uh, yesterday topped over 3,000 participants for the Saturday races. So Nice. Yeah. So there is still time to register um, Wednesday, again, that yep. was the last day. But if somebody were to come out that morning uh, to spectate, is there anything they should know logistically wise as far as parking or anything oh, like yeah. that? <laughs> uh, parking's lots of fun. So, you know, we have to close down all the streets um, pretty early. They do checks that are necessary to keep the participants safe. Um, and so, yeah, the earlier you get there before the road closures, but, you know, there's a lot of parking garages, um, and the weather looks like it'll be really nice. So For I mean, runners, perfect. yes. <laughs> perfect, yeah, perfect for runners, um, but, you know, bearable for the rest of us okay. that won't be moving that fast. Right. And, of course, there's all the fun that's at the neighborhoods, too, so you yeah. can always see everybody yeah. run there. Mm -hmm. Satin, thank you so much for stopping by. We appreciate it. The Fort for Fitness Fall Festival is Saturday, October 1st. That first race starts at 7.30, and the popular four mile is at 10.30. Wednesday, your last day to register. Remember that. And we'll have a link to register inside this story on Wayne.com later today.